Hello guys, welcome to my channel. In this video, I am going to integrate the pickle file into my Django project. In the previous video, I discussed and creating the pickle file. If you haven't watched that video, you can access that video from the movie recommendation system playlist of my YouTube channel. So, here I already created the Django project and I work on the project. The final output of my project is look like this so i will explain you each and everything uh, beginning to end so at first open your command prompt where you want to create the django project so and after that run the command django admin start project and project name in my case, the project name is the blog, not blog, the movies are. So after that, now change your directory to the movies are directory and insert the movies are directory. Create the app with the command python manage.py start app and in my case the app name is blog so i read this command now this is the pickle file i copy this pickle file and after copy this pickle file insert the movies or directory there is the blog directory insert the blog and i paste it here you can see now after that after that I minimize this command prompt and I open this movies or directory insert the view score and which is look like this and insert the movies or directory there is a setting.py file and in the setting.py file I include the install app which name is block insert the install app list now in the url.py file I forward the path for all the function that I defined insert the views Use file, use file of block a here. At first, I refund the path for the home function. Home function. Let me see the home function which is inside the views dot by file. Now, in the home function, this function return the movies. This function return the movies which is which I access from this pickle file. Here is the line of code. This function read the pickle file in the in the Django. You have to provide the full path for the file which you are going to read. So this is the reason I provide the full path for this pickle file. Now here uh, this home function return the home.html file. Uh, this function is moved toward the home.html file with the movies value. Let me see the home.html file which is inside the template directory. Inside the template directory, there is home.html file. Here I applied the looping for loop and which show the movies over on movies. And at first, at first, here you can see I extend the base.html file. Inside the base.html file, I provide some CSS and used uh, navbar. So, let me see. Here is the home.html file, which is the home page of our project. You can see this is the navbar is shown here, uh, which is extend from the base.html file. And this is the overall movies. Uh, here guys when I refresh this page every time you can see the random movies is shown here this is because of this this because of this here you can see guys when every time I call this I refresh the home page and this uh, it call this function and it randomly the randomly generate movies is open inside the movies list so this is the reason the 
this is the reason the random movies is shown there when I refresh this page so when I click on the particular movie it moved toward the, the detail page here in the URL you can see it moved toward the detail page along with the movies name let me show you inside the home.html file in the home page there is a lot of movies are shown when I click on the particular movies it is moved toward the detail page along with that movies so in the url.py file you can see with the detail in the url if this pattern is matches in the url it moved toward the detail function which is inside the views file let me move toward the views file inside the views file you can see there is a detail function in the detail function at first it access the movies not at not first it read the pickle file and in the second you can see it access the movies which is comes in the url and that movies is assigned to the views variable here the if loop is executed here in the if loop if that movies is inside the pickle file then it move to the detail.html file along with that movies if the particular movies is not if the particular movie is not in the pickle file indexes of the pickle file then it moved toward the detail.html file along with the movies and message the movie is not found let me show you what's uh, that i'm going to say you can see here this screen the crane movies is inside the pickle file this the so this is the reason it is shown uh, this overall the rating dot movies the crane and the red uh, this all section let me show you i delete this and pass anything else and this is the uh, this is not insert inside our pickle file so this is the region it say that this movies or uh, these things is not in our pickle file so this is the region it is not found so i move to the backward and let me show you in the detail.html file in the detail.html file when i click on the done after after providing the detail and uh, not detail I pro after providing the rating for this movies it moved toward the recommendation page with along with the movie's name and rating let me show you i provide the rating for this movies and click on the done it moved toward the recommendation page along with the movies and rating here in the url.py file uh, this recommendation uh, you can this recommendation is matches in the URL so this the reason it moved toward the recommendation function which is inside the views file now inside the views.py file you can see there is a recommendation function uh, now you can see this is the movies which is comes in the URL is assigned to the movies variable and this is the rating which is comes in the URL is assigned to the this rating and after that uh, here is a some set of function which is called and after that uh, it moved to the recommendation.html page recommendation.html file along with the movies the recommended movie let me show you in the inside the recommendation.html file here is the movies which is the recommend movies which is shown here here you can see the recommend movie for the crane are given below so only this much for this video guys if you like this video give the thumbs up subscribe this channel and don't you worry about that i will provide the source code in the description below you can check out the description and thank you for watching guys